WWE 2K24 has come out with a new patch that a lot of you guys aren't hyped about. We went over the patch notes yesterday. There wasn't much to talk about, but you know what, man? We got to talk about it. We got some moves. We got some little things here and there with this DLC that did make me excited as a fan, as a player, as a consumer. Because, man, we've been waiting so desperately for a good update. And I'm not saying this is a great update, but there was definitely some things added. Now, let's go on ahead and get started with those details, y'all. Now, with moves. Moves are a big, big thing. Over 75 moves and taunts were marketed with the new promo trailer, whatever you guys want to call it. And uh, yeah, we've seen some moves, man. New choke slam animation with the pin combo was added as a part of Jade Cargill's move set, which is really, really dope. And Jade Cargill has a finisher where she actually does the pin animation where she licks her finger. I mean, hey, bro, that's dope. You know what I'm saying? I'm glad that that was added with the move sets and everything like that new moves are good for the game are good for the longevity we can do more stuff aj style there is a supine position or supine or supine sorry if i said that wrong position faith breaker in the dlc and it fits aj styles very well you know what i'm saying commentary calls it the styles clash so that is pretty dope too that is a little like little little treat little gem in there for you guys for you that are looking for new aj finisher the styles clash that is there for you it is a pretty dope one and i'm glad that the commentary approaches it by calling it the styles clash as i think that that's great for the dlc i think that this is a very good thing for dragon lee brian williams uh you know head developer for the wwe 2k games he did go on ahead and let us know that you can actually bring down dragon lee's knee pad manually with a taunt just like you can take off the singlet like for braun breaker or any other guys that have a singlet i think that this is very cool as well I definitely want to talk about that. I think that this is one of the best little features, little things added with this DLC. And you can do that at any point in the match by using the right trigger and the down D-pad button. I think that that is a W. I'm really looking forward to seeing, you know, this in game and me doing it. And then you can do his finisher with the knee. You know what I'm saying? So very dope stuff. Really looking forward to it. And Lay Cool's entrance was added to the game as way cool. You guys will see that in there as part of the patch. That is a very, very, very dope entrance, but we are missing Layla, which I don't know if we'll ever get because apparently she said she wants nothing to do with the E anymore. So I'm hoping that we do get Layla back in the game at some point as I remember Michelle and Layla from my childhood, man. And I think that this is dope to have in the game. So we're relying on community creations. You boys, you women, let us know down below. If you guys are any, you know, creators, let me know down below, man. I'm probably going to do a little showcase series again again and, and continue that let me know man what is up any creations you guys have with layla i am looking for one and i'm sure the people are looking as well now this is a funny detail y'all that we've never seen dragon lee unmasked and <laughs> with this patch dragon lee was unmasked he was unmasked in this patch and i think that it is one of the funniest things ever the way for us to find out how a wrestler looks unmasked is just kind of crazy you know what i'm saying so as you guys see here dragon lee unmasked if you guys want to use him as a wrestler without no mask i think that's dope too i'm not gonna lie so really looking forward to using him and maybe even doing like a unmasked storyline in the game would be really really dope to see another thing i do want to mention is that they added a new kabuki warriors finisher as part of the move sets i know we went over the moves earlier but this i cannot go and forget about the kabuki warriors finisher is in the game another big win for the 2k you know side the 2k gameplay side i think that this is huge man adding new moves to try and keep up with the game is good i just wish that they had that same energy for theme songs different entrances different titan trons it would be dope if they had that same energy because man it would look good. Now, this is the time for me to crap on AEW Fight Forever. This is a comparison between Jade Cargill in WWE 2K24 and Jade Cargill in AEW Fight Forever. Now, brother, the comparison is huge. You cannot compare that. This comparison is crazy. Now, I do want to point out this is one of the most beautiful looking DLCs 
in a while this is awesome i love this dlc the way it looks the way it, it, it looks in game from what i've seen so far it looks good jade cargill looks amazing in this game dragon lee looks amazing lyra looks amazing naya looks amazing i mean i can go on and on carlito looks amazing as well they've done such a good job designing this you know pack and just doing well by the people you guys got to be hyped about that i know you guys are talking about the game is dead and this that and the other i'm not saying you're wrong the game's been dead for about two months now but they are still putting a lot of effort into this dlc i just wish that we saw some more bigger changes in this patch but unfortunately that's not what we got to see here so we definitely got to keep our eyes out for that and just you know possibly seeing more throughout the year even though i doubt it but we only got one more dlc pack left in the cycle y'all and that is in november for the wcw pack new my faction cards were added with juan cena and dominic mysterio i did go briefly over that in the last video so that's another thing that we you know got to briefly mention as part of the details added honestly this is probably the least details added i've seen so far in a wwe 2k24 dlc patch if i'm being honest lots of new stuff got added but it's not hitting like the other patches you know what i'm saying i could usually get two or three videos out for you guys just talking about different things and whatnot but unfortunately i haven't been able to get that and i think that this might just be a one video series you know what i'm saying so carlito he does have a very dope taunt where he goes on ahead and slaps the wrestler takes a bite out the apple and spits it in their face dope stuff we've kind of seen this with the trailer as well so the taunts the moves they're there the graphics on these wrestlers looks great but honestly i was expecting a little bit more call me a negative nancy call me whatever you want to call me i was just expecting a little bit more y'all you know what i mean and i'm sure you guys had a little bit more you know higher expectations unfortunately this is what we're dealt with again it's not a bad patch i don't want that to be misinterpreted that way i just really hope to see some more stuff you know throughout the year we're only seven months into the cycle and we say that a lot but we we need we need to keep this up you know what i'm saying 2k we still got close to half the cycle left and it feels like this game has really really died out it's really struggling a little bit and again good patch good additions but it left me desiring more based on the patches that you guys have done before now the move sets are good the move sets have improved the taunts have improved graphically the game looks amazing i just got to point that out one more time but that's just where i'm at with this man now if you guys did find any more details let me know down below because i really haven't found anything else and shout out to twitter shout out to you guys for putting it in a timeline tagging me letting me know what's up because it does it, it does make a big help for when i'm making these type of videos where i'm able to just look talk about it and you know continue the more content we can get the more content i can you know give you guys in return but if you guys did enjoy this video Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe. Let me know down below. Is there something that you desired out this patch? What would you rate this patch out of 10? Let me know down below, man. I'm going to catch y'all. Peace.